Alrighty, Wednesday, December 23rd, 2020, 6.30 a.m. Uh, what we're going to do now is we're going to go short. Massive resistance here. This red line has been uh, massive resistance, so we're going to go short. Five, let's do that. Okay, we're filled. And we are short five S&P minis at... 36, 87 and 3 quarters. Okay, let's look at some of the charts. Here's the one minute chart. Okay, on the one minute you see this red line. Very important uh, line, you see? This red moving average. Every time it held up, so uh, we're gonna see if it breaks. It looks like it will break it, and once it breaks it, we think there could be a lot of selling that may intensify. Uh, right now the market's up 10.5, which is 0.29%. And then let's look at the 10 minute real quick. And okay, here we see we're trying to go under the lines. We have massive resistance here. And let's look at the 30 minute. Okay, in the 30 minute, we see again this red line. Let's look at the hour. Okay, hour also, this blue moving average, this dark, um, darker blue moving average, is, is looking like it's a um, you know, uh, massive resistance for it. And then in terms of the daily chart, we see the market rallied up above this blue, well, light blue cayenne uh, moving average right there, you see? And we're going to see if it goes back and uh, tries to break down and test the 3600 level in the coming days. Okay, uh, let's go back to the one minute real quick. Okay, we see that we are starting to get really close to penetrating this red moving average. Very uh, important. Okay, in terms of our moving average, I'm sorry, our stop. We'll put in our stop at 3,700 and a half, okay, 3,700 and a half, there we go, okay, our stop is in at 3,700 and a half, and that's the story, okay. Alrighty, it is Wednesday, December 23rd, 2020, 6.37 a.m. Quick update. We are through this red line. We just penetrated it. We broke through it, you see, uh, right here. So we are under this red line, finally. Uh, so let's see if that selling intensifies. There's a long way down from here. Okay, let's see. Alrighty, it is Wednesday, December 23rd, 1.13 p.m. And let's look at what's going on. So we were just stopped out of our trade, okay? Uh, we're down about 3,187.50. Uh, so let's look at what happened here. So we were stopped out. Uh, we went short at 36.87 and three quarters. And then we um, got stopped out at 3700 and a half uh just now <laughs> literally just now um okay and let's just um okay have it like that have the order now let's look what happened here um okay so we see a very um here on the one minute we see like a very uh mostly up pattern i mean the market's up 23 points but very, you know, shaky along the way um, as it was going up. Let's look at the 30 minute to get a better idea. And here we see on the 30 minute, uh, we did break this red moving average, but yet we're sitting at massive resistance at around the 3,700 level. Okay, let's look at the daily chart. Let's see what that looks like. Okay, and the daily chart also, it's its kind of, looks like there's a lot of resistance here. Um, let's look at the 30 minute. Oh, wait, wait, I think we did that. Let's, okay, let's look at the 10 minute. Here we go. 
And then on the 10 minute, we see also that big rally, but you see a steep sell off from 36.90 to the support and then back to the highs. So really strong rally there as well. Uh, we're gonna still go short, okay? Here, we're starting to go again under the 3700 level. We're gonna go short. We still think the market's going lower. Uh, the up move did not have a lot of conviction. Here we are. So we are short um, at 3700 even. We're short five. Uh, this um, is Wednesday, December 23rd, 2020. And it's 1.15 p.m. So we are short five right now. Okay. And now in terms of this, we have a high of 3,700 and three quarters. So in terms of the stop, what we'll do is we'll put it at, um, we'll put a stop. Oops. We'll put a stop at, 37, 12 and a half, okay? That'll be our stop, okay? Um, here we go, we're in. Okay, and the market is at 36.99 uh, and three quarters right now. Again, you see this, it's mostly up, but you see how the sell-offs have been very steep and it's kind of like, there's a lot of selling every step of the way and it's kind of like a slow grind up. Um, yeah, I, I really feel that we're still gonna go lower and potentially go back to 36.84, um, maybe even lower from there. So we'll have to see, I mean, the low is 36.51, the high is 37.3 and three quarters. Right now we're at 36.99 and a half. We're up 22 and a quarter points. We're up 0.61% on the day and here you see we're starting to sell off now okay so it does still look toppy so yeah we got stopped out which is fine we're back in the market and our stop is in all right see you guys soon all righty it is wednesday december 23rd 2020 3 58 p.m we have about a minute 359 actually about a minute to go before the market closes uh, right now we are flat. Uh, actually, we're up <laughs> 250 at the moment. Uh, so our trade, the second one, really worked out when we shorted the market, um, and we just need to get out of it now. Uh, let's look at what's going on here. The one minute you see a breakdown. Uh, finally, <laughs> we've been waiting for it for a while. Okay, uh, hold on. Let me go to the five minute and back to the one minute it's giving me an issue but here look at the one minute so we see this okay uh, and here you go you see the one minute right now breaking down okay going to the lows alrighty um, finally 3680 like we were saying uh, we were looking for this all day um, patience is important when you trade you know we are not about, you know, rushing to make money. And yes, we're mostly day trading or out in and out within a few days, but uh, we still are patient and we don't just like jump around 20,000 times. Okay, um, so here we got the 30 minute sitting around 36.80. Okay, let's decide what are we gonna do. So in terms of the one minute chart, let's see where we're at now. We're at 36.83. So what we'll do is we will replace this order, okay, and we'll put it in for a limit order for 36.72, there we go, okay, um, yeah, let's put it in 36.72 even. Okay, and here we go. We're canceling the other order, and we have an open order right now for 36.72. Um, and the market just closed, the New York Stock Exchange, I mean, and we have uh, 14 minutes by when we want to get out of this trade. We don't want to hold this overnight. So, in terms of what's going on with the, let's look at the daily chart first. 
Okay, we see that we've created basically a flat uh, day. We had a little bit of a high back to 37.0. Well, actually, I'll tell you exactly. 37.01 and three quarters. And then we had a low of 36.51. And we closed just around in the middle of the range. Okay, that's what the candlestick tells us. And basically kind of a flat day. And we're still building up this top. Okay, we're still building up a really big top, which either uh, we break out of, and what I think more is that we may actually break down here. Uh, so we'll have to see, like if we break, especially if we break the 3600 le uh, level solidly. But we'll have to see. Uh, that's the, um, that is the daily chart. Let's get the hourly chart. The hourly chart, we see uh, this 3680 level. All the moving averages are basically being tested right now. The last hour, literally, look at that. In the last hour, um, we basically, for the closing hour of the New York Stock Exchange, the market just went from that high of like 36.97, I'm guessing, on that hour. 36.96, yeah, 96 and three quarters, uh, to all the way down to 36.80 and a lot of volume as well. So here we are, we're at 3679, 78 and three quarters. So let's see if we break down. I mean, if we break down, the next target could be 3650 and then 3600. I mean, that's what it looks like. You tell me, I mean, here's the chart and it looks very clearly like the next target is 3650 and then after that is 3600. But I don't know if it's gonna happen immediately. We'll have to see if it takes a few days or so. Um, and don't forget that there's a holiday coming up. Uh, okay, so in terms of the 30 minute, and we're in, uh, we're at 36.79 right now. So let's let's try to get filled. Okay, we have uh, 12 minutes left. Uh, 30 minute chart we see breaking down through all the moving averages as well on the on the candle, the hour before huge volume, uh, and then look now is actually breaking down through the blue after going trying to go back up and hitting support. So that's also uh, pretty uh, encouraging for any shorts. And ideally, you know, I mean, uh, if we'd have a fund, we'd, maybe we would just hold this short position for a few weeks or so and, and see what happens. But, you know, we are trading day to day right now during this challenge. So let's look at the 10 minute chart. And we're ready at 36.78 and a quarter. We're getting close. Our order is sitting there. <laughs> Okay, here we go. Uh, we're breaking down, again, all the averages. And look how now we went s solidly under the red moving average. And uh, yeah, it looks like 36.70 and 36.55 are the big, are the big uh, targets for that right there. Okay, five minute chart. We have Okay, we have a big breakdown too. Okay, 77 and three quarters. Let's look at the three minute. Okay, breaking down 77 and a half now. Okay, through all the moving averages, broke that red line. Okay, after having that big rally up. Okay, and like I said, patience pays off. <laughs> you know, that's one thing you'll see in the way we've been trading with our challenge. 99% of the time we're out within, you know, by 4.15 within the session. A few times we held things overnight, maybe twice. Um, and the last time it really worked out for us very well. We held it over the weekend from Friday to uh, Monday and that, that was our best day yet. Okay, so uh, one minute we see this breakdown as well. So we're 10 minutes away from the close of our closing time. And we're at 36.77 even. Okay, now in terms of uh, if we're going to revise it, no, we're just going to leave 3672 for now, and maybe in a few minutes we'll change it if we don't get filled. All right, let's see what happens. Alrighty, we're about to close. Let's replace this with a market order. There we go, real quick. Okay, and we are almost. Oh, wait, where is our order? Hmm. Cancel, replace. Oops, market. Okay, hold on, guys. 
And we are out. Okay. We got filled. We bought um, five at 36.78. Fantastic day. We are closing up after our bigger, you know, big loss earlier. Uh, where we were down over 3,000, I believe. We are up 1.37%. We are up $2,312.50 this Wednesday, December 23rd, 2020. And our equity is now $169,176.50. Again, it's $169,176.50. I believe that's a brand new fresh high. Uh, in terms of our closing equity since we've started the challenge. And, you know, now that we're in overtime, we're beyond the 30 days. So, uh, yeah, very encouraged. We're getting that much closer. We're uh, under $1,000 away. We're, um, you know, actually less than $900 away from uh, $170,000. And like I said, we're going to work really hard to get this to two hundred. dollars um, by the end of the year by the last trading day and we have a few more trading days left and we also have the holidays so uh we basically within the next you know four or five days of trading we're gonna look to to you know make about i would say 30 to forty thousand or fifty thousand you know so all right let's see what happens i hope you guys are excited because i am